Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the world's worst Let's Play of Portal 2, where something's gonna happen, I don't know. Uh, but I have a, sh a quick story to tell you guys, uh, once GLaDOS finishes talking, because I'm sure she'll say something else. 21 and 22, we're almost done, I, I guess. Uh-huh. Oh, she's not gonna say, okay, well, that's fine then. Um, so last night, uh, my wife was swimming with a friend in our pool and I was I was walking around the pool you know checking it out and I saw a toad and I was like cool toad so I picked it up and I'm like this guy is a pretty chunky guy he's like a, a, a nice palm sized toad you know like fits in nicely in the side the palm of your hand and I I like frogs all right so I'm like a big big frog guy if I see a, see a frog or a toad I'm like I gotta get I gotta get him I gotta get him I can't not get him because they're what's going on off the lights. Hey, buddy, I'm speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. Look, Metal Ball, I can hear you. Run! I don't need to do the voice. Run! Run! Okay, uh, we'll continue this story in a Come moment. On. Come on! Run! Come on! I'm closing the door. Okay, quick recap. We are escaping. All right, that's what's happening now. We're escaping. Uh, so you're doing great. Just keep running. Uh, quick word about the future plans that I've got in store. We're going to shut down the current production line, all right? Turn off our neurotoxin and then... Again, though, for the moment, run! What? Come on, come on! Okay. The irony is you are almost at the last test. Here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever asinine plan your friend came up with. Oh, what? How, how stupid does she think we are? I'm stuck in a bridge. There we go. Whoop. Nope, I'm... Oh, apparently I crouched and didn't realize it. So wait. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh look, there's a deer. You probably can't see it. Get closer. There's a heart on the wall. Wait, now I have options? But I want the options. Do I just die? I die. But I got an achievement, which means I did the right thing. you are almost at the last test. Here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever ass mine. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh look, there's a deer. Because if I just get close, it is. Ah, she closes it. Oh! Okay, I missed that part. Completely missed that part. Did not see that it closed behind me the first time. Didn't didn't know that happened. I thought I just done a thing. Okay. Sure. Now I get it. Now I get it. Okay. Okay. How stupid does she think we are? So no. Definitely just gonna keep doing this thing that I'm doing. Oh, good. Awkward loading point. Anyway, so this toad. Oh, just kidding. Okay. Uh huh. 48. Okay. Ah. Okay. Um. Well, we have a portal. Music is bumping. That's that's crazy, right? Um. Wheatley, what was your plan, sir? Okay, so I can just keep just doing this? Yeah, cool. Alright. What do I look like? Oh. Okay. Um. Alright. Anyway. 
kind of forgot what I was doing. Not gonna lie. Got a little bit distracted. Wait. What's that? Nothing. It is nothing. What am I supposed to do here? Just kidding. I see what I'm supposed to do. Bop. You're okay? Great, come on. Hello. Oh, what's this way? It's just a rabbit round. Of course. Okay. Um. Uh-huh. But I wanna But I wanna know what's that way. I want to explore. Okay. There's a lot going on here. Um Can't go that way. Alrighty. Um Okay. Well, nope, can't go that way. Gotta go uh to elevator. Um Why would she destroy the whole testing facility if she Wait, I was I uh mm. So anyway, this toad. So I'm holding the toad, right? The escape. So I'm holding this toad, right? Hold on, let me let me just let me Nope, let me um let me set up my good my good story loop here. Okay, good good story loop and there we go okay so um, I got this toad in one hand right holding this toad and I'm like hey little guy and and I, I'm this isn't working this is a bad story loop bad story loop let me let me try again let me get this story loop going there we go nope there we go okay so anyway so I'm holding this toad right and I'm like cool toad so I show my dog and my dog sniffs this toad once and goes absolutely crazy. Starts like zooming around, going nuts, like barking ferociously, like going absolutely nutso out of her mind, digging up the garden, just wild, right? Apparently she does not like amphibians or, t or snakes or anything of the reptilian, even slight nature, because she goes bananas, all right? So then I I'm like, all right, time to put the toad back. And and I start walking, and I kid you not, there was another toad! This was a little bit smaller, uh, but another toad! So I, like, take my other hand, you know, because this one's already toaded up, and I just swoop up and, and scoop up another toad. So then, I am double toading hands, right? Like, I got a toad in each hand, and I'm like, heck yeah, I have never felt so powerful before in my life. Let's switch to the orange. I have never felt this powerful in my life. What do I do with this newfound power? So I take the toads and I'm like, look, look people, the, the two toads. And I'm like, I bet they were looking for each other. I'm a marry them. And I made them kiss each other. And then I was like, okay, I've had enough fun with my toads. I'm going to put them away. So then I put them under the fence so they didn't fall into the pool. So um, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I was I was happy about my my double my double toed adventures. Okay, moving on. Just getting this way. Just getting this way. Okay, now we're good. Ah, oh, brilliant! You made it through. Well done. Okay, follow me. We've still got work to do. Well, honey, see where you are. Ah. I mean, she can't touch us. She literally runs the facility, bro. Um. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, don't. Move. I'm moving. I'm I'm moving and okay. jumping. All right. So I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Here we go. Ah! Oh, for God's! They told me that if I ever turned this flashlight on, I would die. They told me that about everything. I mean, I, I don't even know why they bothered giving me this stuff if they didn't want me to use it. It's pointless, man. Very interesting. Mm-hmm. It's dark down here, isn't it? They say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff of robots. All of them robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the originals. 
No memory of the incident. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Mm. Absolutely terrifying. Though obviously not paranormal in any meaningful way. Where Let's am I going? Moving. The factory entrance must be around here somewhere. Did I go the right way? How are you just following me perfectly? Careful, careful. Wait, wait, careful. Let me light this jump for you. Nailed it. Uh huh. Okay, this looks dangerous. I'll hold the light steady. Oh, nicely done. Okay, I want to go this way first. Because it's the way we're not supposed to go. Right. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh huh. Quick, this way. But I want to go over here. Ah, there's nothing to do here. Okay, we're just gonna. We messed up. We dunked up. Okay. Nope. Dunked up. Here's we're fine. Story. You might like this. Everything's fine. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing, but uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself. Nepotism ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. That the um, sorry, that's uh, no, I would say smelly. Just just attending to the humans. Sorry about that. That just that just slipped out. A little bit sensitive. Yeah. The smelly humans. Okay, we have to split up here for a moment. Portal up to that passage, and I'll see you on the other side. What was your plan if I didn't have a portal gun, my guy? Like actually, though, you know. Okay. We've got to get you out of that room. Can you reach that wall back there? What wall? Oh, this wall with the perfectly timed blocking things? You know, like kind of gamey. Okay, oh, nope, wrong way again. Okay, there's another wall over here. Okay. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans? Oh, love them. Just the way they look. It's great. And their folklore. Wonderful. Folklore. Colorful. Uh huh. Well, part of me just wants to jump. But I'm probably not supposed to. But he's not telling me not to! Right. Well, I'm gonna take this rail down the back way. See you at the bottom. Good luck. You just gotta go down this way, huh? Follow the butterflies, as it were. Alright. Sure! Why not? Um... Well, here's an option. Or... I can keep going. Just kidding, I cannot keep going. I can, though! Not down that way. Oh. Apparently I cannot keep going. And I 100%... That was the illusion of choice. Apparently. Because I 100% could keep going, but it led to nothing. So, you know. Factory. But of course. The factory. Loading screen. Yeah, I figured as much. Uh huh. Okay. What is. Where am I? Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. What does that mean? Like, actually, what does that mean? Okay, so I can go here. From here. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Please exit the turret redemption line. Um. Okay. I suppose we're just walking along. And of course, there are the occasional ones still active. Because. Aww! Ah! 
<laughs> I got an achievement for this. Don't make lemonade. Get mad, don't make lemonade, huh? Prometheus was punished by the gods for giving the gift of knowledge to men. He was cast into the bowels of the air, pecked by birds. What? No, 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 no! I didn't mean to let go. Aw, oh, man! I lost my turret, friend. I did my best. Okay. Ah, I see why they do it. They do it now. I need to. There we go. That's less deadly for me. What? There's a lot going on here. Response. Template. Response. Yeah, I know. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Template. Response. Um. Template. Response. Okay. Oh! Response. Template. Response. So hold up. Template. Response. So if I, oh, I can't, I can't jump. All right. So I got a turret friend again. Okay. Template. Response. Oh, brilliant! You made it through. Well done. Yeah, let's do it. Template. Follow me. You're gonna love this. Um, I'm bringing him with me. I lost the one. I'm not losing another. Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. Template. See that scanner right there, right? It's deciding which turrets to keep and which to toss, and it's using that template. master turret there Response. as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template turret, it'll shut down the whole production template. line. Right, um, hmm. I'm gonna have to hack the door so that we can get So was it. I supposed to grab this guy the whole time? You'll need to turn around while I do this. Oh my gosh. Turn around, done. Template. Yeah. Okay, go on, just pull that turret out. Okay. Well, Response. that should do it. Template missing. Continuing from memory. Oh, it hasn't done it. What, 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 what do you have there? What, what are you? Oh, brilliant! It's, that's brilliant! New template accepted. If we're lucky, she won't find out all her turrets are crap until it's too late. <laughs> Classic. Okay, keep your eye on the turret line. I'm gonna go and hack the door open. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. Response. It's a little bit more complicated than it looks from your side. It should take about 10 minutes. Keep Jump one up. eye on the door. Response. <laughs> I love this. I love that I accidentaled into it again. This door's actually pretty complicated. That's amazing. How long's the door been open? I mean, was there any sort of announcement before it opened? Like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind? Or like a hacker alert? I mean, yeah, fair enough, the important thing is it's open, but it's, in, it's just mentioned in the future. Cough or something. All right, now, she can't use her toxin tanks, production so employee daycare center. Toxin generator as well. But the... I want this. I want this. Daycare center, huh? Okay. Bring your daughter to work day. That did not end well. 
And 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realise they're children, but still, you know, low-hanging fruit and all that. Barely science, really, is it? Wait, Baking volcano? volcano? Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery. Battery, I'll give it not that, a lemon. It's not terrifically original, is it? You Which know what I mean? Which potato. Well, it's actually primary research, even within the child sciences. What? Anything is possible with science. Okay. All right, well, we are at the end of this episode. It's growing right up into the ceiling. That's a giant. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? What at least you won't starve, though. My goodness. All right. Well, hey, we're going to pick this up on the next episode. So, see you guys then. Bye-bye.